No update at this point. Um, when you kind of look at this, did you see a common denominator with the turnovers? I think 17 turnovers for, for 32 points. It's obviously the ball game there. Did you, did you see something consistently happening with those? Um, yeah, there was 19 turnovers, 32 points. Um, they have scored us 28 to two in fast break points. Um, and the crazy thing is, you know, uh, first quarter, we were awful taking care of it. Um, second quarter, we were much better. And um, I, I thought the, the key to this game was the last three minutes or so of that second quarter. Um, they closed on an 18 to three run. And uh, the most disappointing thing about that run by Portland is that everything that was working for us to that point, the ball movement, making the extra pass, executing, uh, went out the window. And all of a sudden we became a, a, a selfish basketball team. A lot of one-on-one, -on -one, a lot of dribbling, uh, which led to more turnovers. Uh, and that's where we lost the game. Um, so yeah, turnovers, just holding on to it, trying to do too much, not making plays for anybody. Um, and you go on the road against a, a team like this and you give them extra possession after extra possession, um, you know, it's going to make it really hard to win. Was that the message post game to the guys that, you know, you guys can't win on the road with selfish basketball? Uh, there were a lot of thing, things that you know, we're not going to get into. That stays in the locker room. But we lost five in a row. We're not playing good basketball. Uh, and, and I, as a head coach, have to do a much better job. Are, are there any positives that you can take away? I know Jeff Green no. led you guys with. No. Oh, okay. No. We got our ass kicked again. Lost by 19 points on the road. There are no silver linings. There are no moral victories. There's nothing to feel good about. We've lost five games in a row. End of story. Go ahead, Matt Moore. At this point with the injuries, is there anything that you feel like you have to focus on in terms of approach or is it, I know that you guys are always talking about next man up. I know you've been here before, but this is an exceptional amount of what you're dealing with right now, early in the season with a lot of games to go. Yeah. I mean, I, I have to control the controllables. You know, I, I can't control who's out, who's injured, who's available. You know, that, that's out of my reach. Um, I can control doing my job as a head coach and getting us to play the right way. Um, and for five games now, we have not played the right way in either end of the floor. Um, so uh, that's what I'm worried about. Uh, I don't, who's available is who is available. You know, every, every team goes through it. Um, but I was just really disappointed in um, to just how we play. You know, we've never been a selfish type of a team, a team that is looking to get theirs. And that stretch in that second quarter, you know, uh, 18 to three run. And if you go back every game this season, every game this season, uh, we have allowed opposing teams to go on multiple huge runs. And, uh, you know, at some point, you know, don't get bored with success. If something is working, just stay with it. And if it's not your night, maybe it's somebody else's night, but just continue to play the right way. Uh, and that has to be our mindset going home against Milwaukee. Thank you, Coach. Yeah.